Hey guys, Joseph here. So, another day, it is the 4th of July. I have a service call to run over in Parkland, Florida. Um, this specific customer, he gives my name to pretty much everybody in the neighborhood. So I'm gonna take care of him today. Even though it is a holiday, I'm gonna go out there and try to see if I can take care of him. So, show you guys what a typical service call looks like. We'll get to it. Down to State Road 810 West toward Parkland. Keep right. Then turn All right, so we have arrived. Uh, for the most part, what I usually like to do when I first get inside the house, um, I don't like to carry a bunch of tools. I kind of just like to um, get the bare minimum of what I need. So a little go bag, a drill, and a screwdriver, and that should be it for now. But the most important thing, when you go in someone's house, it's going to be booties. Can't forget about the booties. All right, so I went up inside the attic. That's where the air handlers were located. Uh, for this specific one, um, his thermostat wouldn't go below 78. Um, so I checked the thermostat, everything was good with that. Uh, I came up to the upstairs uh, inside the attic, um, and this is what I found. So there, for some reason, they opened the ductwork in the past, and then they try to seal it with this crappy tape. Um, and that's not gonna do it, that's not gonna hold up. At this point, he probably does need new plenums, uh, which is the ductwork that attaches to the air conditioner. Um, it's 4th of July, it's an emergency call, so I'm probably just gonna tape it, seal it, mastic seal, um, and he should be good to go until he gets these plenums replaced because they desperately need to. So, let's get to it. So another thing, So uh, a ton of glue, spray glue. All right, so there's that metal tape over the top. Just go around, make sure it's tight. And I use metal tape. So we'll let that sit for a little bit and then mastic seal. So what I usually like to do, you don't really have to be too shy with this. Just load it up. And this is gonna get replaced. So I'm not really gonna make it look too pretty. I just wanna make sure he's gonna get through the weekend. Uh, he can get some sleep because it's probably about a thousand degrees in there. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So for the most part, I'll let this sit probably for about 45 minutes make sure it's dry turn it on make sure it cools down and you should be good to go right. so it's been about 45 minutes we're going to turn it back on all right go. so i was just up in the attic for probably about 45 minutes what i like to do on calls like this um is vacuum all the drains in the house so i don't have to come back for some miscellaneous service call that i should have gotten taken care of in the first place all right and there you have it typical ac service call down in south florida um from start to finish probably took me about two hours um so that attic was probably 140 degrees so it's pretty hot i wanted to get in and out i didn't really want to take too much longer than i had to up there but they're gonna get the plenums replaced um which is the duckboard that attaches to the air conditioner and that will probably take about four to six hours so um that's it. Any questions or concerns, let me know.